above anything else, mate, there's one thing that I do that makes me so good at cold approaching. That makes me so good at the ability of stopping a girl on the street and very quickly flow into this dynamic of a fun, exciting, engaging conversation. I think a big problem that many guys face is they overthink the game side of things. They overthink exactly what to say, how to say it, psychological techniques, push and pull, teasing, assumptions, all this stuff, right? Which is important, definitely. Otherwise, I wouldn't share it. It's definitely important, but there's one thing that must come first. If you don't have this you know, first fundamental thing, none of that comes after. Right, none of that is, there's no point in all of this if you don't have this first thing. What I'm able to do so well, or the reason why my interactions are nearly always pretty good, is because I'm, a, it's because I'm able to build comfort with the girl. That is the most important thing that you need to do, mate. Because the only way you can do all the other stuff is if the girl is comfortable enough to stay in that interaction with you. Because if she's not comfortable, she'll just leave, right? She'll leave the interaction and you've got no opportunity to, you've got no opportunity to use those other things, right? So how do I do that? How do I do that so well? It's simple. I assume familiarity. I assume and I pretend that the girl is a familiar person. The girl is somebody that I already know. And I do this exactly for the purpose of building that comfort. Think about it. If you were stood there, right, and on this side was a familiar face, and on the other side was someone that you completely, like, completely unknown to you, right? A stranger you met for the first time that you saw for the first time. How would you feel to, towards these two different people? How would you feel to the, towards a stranger? And how would you feel towards a familiar face? Undoubtedly, you'd feel more comfortable with this familiar face. You'd feel more comfortable around this familiar face because you know the person as opposed to this random stranger who you've never met before. And this is exactly the principle that you must adopt and take into your cold approaches. If you stop a girl and the way you carry yourself, the way you speak, the way that you use your body language, if that is one of a stranger if the girl deems you as a stranger throughout the interaction, you're not going to get anywhere, right? Because she can never truly feel comfortable around you if she deems you to be a stranger. Whereas on the flip side, if you're able to convey yourself in a way that almost seems, that almost makes it come across like you know that person, the way you come across, the way you convey yourself is similar to how a friend of hers would act towards her. Well, then she can begin to play with that idea. She can almost imagine that you are a familiar face. And if you are a familiar face, she's much more likely to feel that comfort. Her comfort levels are going to vastly increase. And only at that point does all that game come into play? Because at that point, you've actually got the girl in the interaction. And then you can use the game to take it from just a boring, bland, you know, quite basic interaction to a much more fruitful, exciting one. But I emphasize, you can only do all the game stuff if the girl stays in the interaction with you in the first place. Because if you can't assume familiarity, if you can't come across as a friendly, safe 
you know, above all, like a safe individual to speak to in the first few seconds, the girl's not gonna stick around for the rest of it. She'll be gone, right? She might get creeped out, she might get scared, she might get a bit anxious and go off. And then all this game that you've learned, all this game that you wanna try and implement into your interactions, you can't use because you've neglected the most important aspect, which is to actually get in a position where the girl is happy to have a conversation with you. I generally believe, mate, that assuming familiarity, like having this just utmost mindset that this girl that I'm approaching is somebody that I already know, is the main reason why I very, very rarely get blown out, right? Even if the girl is not interested, even if the girl wants to reject me, most of the time, she still sticks around for the conversation. Because I'm able to convey this familiarity so well. I'm able to be open and genuine so well and make the girl feel at ease straight away or within you know, just a matter of seconds. So that's the first thing that you should be, that you should be working on. Of course, it's important to have an, have an understanding, have an idea of, of everything else, like the tease and the flirt and the push and pull, the assumption making, like how to close an interaction to give yourself the best chance of actually going on a date with this girl. Like all that is very, very important as well. But the, the first thing you need to master, the thing that should be on top of your priority list, mate, the first thing you look to master within social interactions and cold approaching girls is building that familiarity is building that comfort level. Because if you can't do this, well then everything else is worthless.